That's a big gift though, and we're still waiting for the final pick from Ultra Rico. It's gonna be the Faramis on top of all this mobility. When it comes to a brawl in the mid game, I feel like Aura has slapped. They're now going and centering on this turtle. Brave Spider into the death of this wall. Come on, Ron, gonna be able to find the stun, but Taz walks in with a Tempest of Blades, gets that down, and Brazer's Wrath now used up. Go good. Gonna be taken very low, and oh, it's first blood over to the Tig Reel. Gugun survives somehow. Two levels ahead earlier. Now, oh, Yaoi takes Taz off the wall, goes in, and man, my god. He's got so much space for Gugu to get the retribution. Now, Krite gonna fall in the hands of Aran with a sword. Yaoi targeted down by Taz, who's looking for the assassination. Onto the Roamer, but now he has kill. Walks up, gets oh. the healing. Taz, double the blades, knocking two up, picking up the blades as well, and picking up Yaoi. He has kill. Able to this. To be, have, to be having a bit more of a dueling presence, but Kabuki Ooh. gets jumped on. Almost predicted as well. Kabuki still staying. Blazing the way, gonna be used up as another realm pops in. Go good with a sandwich maneuver. Trying to stop them. That's an implosion as well, catching Nino. And that's a full on initiation from Gugun with the help of the hard guard. Nino gonna be gunned down by Kabuki as Gugun finds a double with an appraiser's wrap. And now. Ooh. Is he really gonna go through this? Seems like he should be able to. He has a retribution. Pulled back, knocked up, and now all run! Oh. Take some that EXP, right? Level 10 compared to that level 11 that Taz has been able to get, but here we go. Yeah, for this welcome though, you cannot go for the retreat battle when you're inside of the stomach of Detena. Aran with a stun onto Krite now has the swings as well in the mid lane. Kabuki with a blazing new weapon. The Nether Realms cancels that out. Gugun, this place for a bit is able to sustain with, with the help. Tree go, they have frontline that can serve as the the main target, but look at Aran. Still able to get some oh. shielding around. Oh my god, flickers forward as well. Did not pay off. Taz was able to escape, and now they're on the back foot. Kabuki still doing some damage right there. There's a good implosion. Catches Nino. Plays into web by Kabuki. Chasing him down. Not able to catch him just yet as Rossi pops in the guiding win. But Pai is all but isolated. The dino taken down. Wait, go for the burst damage and then immediately be able to just escape with the faster movement speed. He's trying to go for it now. He goes for it, the guiding win. Oh, uh, circling Eagle, Rossi flying to his demise. Gugu now going for the taunt, locks him down. Oh, yeah! hey! With an implosion and the instant collapse from the dragons. It's kind of being put on the spot right here, and so is Ultra Ego with the Lord coming through. Boom, that's a charge. Boom, that's Yaoi with a shove back, but Rossi gets up with the guiding win. Gugu in the midst, the Praiser's Wrath. Ooh. Oh, it actually connects onto Nino. Taking him the half HP. Oh! No death as well. Oh, Ross is gonna be shot down from the skies! And now the Dino! What on? With the bravest fighter, Nino popping them with the nature. Kabuki diving deep with a purify, surviving and going back to the battle mirror image. Will finally die, but Taz can only but run away. Aran gets the hard guard. The base gets imploded by Yaoi. And Aura take game one. The Red Dragons lead the series here in this best of three. At the final moment, was that a triple kill? Whose triple kill was that? There were triple kills all the close. Case. But obviously they could just go for a safer choice, which is that x board up against this somewhat tanky team with sustain. Sustain, long, prolonged Miss walkers. Team. It's a blink, right? right? Assassin's usually up against blinks. It's a bit tougher. Yaoi doing the same thing now. Rossi. Supposed to come over, but Yaoi has the wild charge, doesn't even use it. The hard guard gets placed down onto Rossi, but what happens to him? He disappeared. The orange ball taken away as well as Goku. Oh man, it's a slaughter in the bottom lane in the enemy jungle. Burned down now, Pai. Splash by for Rome. That's what he's abusing right now, and the team is trying to follow up on it. He's going. Whoa! Like a wild charge and the pullback as well. The retribution still caught by Taz there. Goku's looking to go for the top down now as Nino puts him in a tough spot with the Rossi with the primal rat. Goku's gonna help. Get helped by the hard guard as Nino dives in deep, and Arana's gonna try to burn him down. Earth Shadow Flicker combo to the back line, and now a penalty zone as well. Aura on the back foot, so trying to cut away. A Heskill with a splash of damage. Meanwhile, up top, the Moskov eating good, going for the turrets. A little bit more survivability on his end. Oh, oh movement speed as well. He's a, he's a level below here, though. Yeah, and Rossi already used the onward. What? Rossi now caught using Primal Wrath, but can't do anything now. Pi. All alone, they are committing for a neutral objective Taz? with an assassin here. Taz in a 1v4 spot. The Ooh. flames will zone him away. Taz will still have. They have to really use the Ling pressure, but at this point, he's just too busy trying to deal with everything else. And Aura, once again, 
to man. While charging the chop down, the penalty zone connects on the three tasks. Walking forward, that's a purple buff reset. Rossi pops into primal rat has to be able to continue this onslaught as he picks up the purple buff. But now the flames as well. Such a chaotic duel in aura. It looks like they come out on top. Yeah, Heskill takes Pi down in the back. Now Nino all alone in the mid lane, only with a yo yo. You can't. How can, how can they clear the Lord with Aura knocking on the door with a, a superior DPS? Yaoi makes the play. It's a wild charge. Kabuki now gonna go for the turret and he ill will be able to melt it down quite easily. Right into the depths of his welcome, he goes. Edith is gone. Pike gets brought back with the missiles now. It's the flames of Aran. Nino gets the helmet. Hard guard. Oh my god! Nino gets killed just by the Moscow hitting the base. He got pierced down. 2 0 for the dragons. I'll beat wounded. I'll beat left down to the ground.